Joining me right now to react, former Trump 2016 economic advisor and former CKE restaurant CEO Andy Putzer. Andy, it's good to see you. I mean, this is, I think, what is here. so sad about this country right now because we all want an opportunity for the American dream. And you and I have been very lucky. And we've had that opportunity, but there's a lot of people today that are working very, very hard, and it's a struggle. And they don't get the handouts that, hey, even some of the illegals coming now to New York City will get from Bill de Blasio or from Gavin Newsom out there in California. What's happened? Well, look, it, it, it's been a real disaster over the past, particularly the past eight to 10 years. Uh, you know, during the Obama era, what we saw was the rich got richer, the poor got richer through more benefits, and the middle class got nothing. Now we're starting to see wages increase for the middle class because there's so many jobs that have been created, so many job openings, that workers, blue collar, working class workers finally have some leverage and we're seeing wages go up 3.2 percent that that hasn't happened in a decade and if you look at the number for just the workers not the managers because you want to get the workers yeah. wages elevated to expand the middle of that uh, hourglass to expand the middle class mm -hmm. you look at for example uh, construction workers construction workers wages generally were up 3.9 percent take the managers out and it was 4.2 percent even restaurant and to what workers. do you attribute that because you know the left says it's it's got to be economic policies left over from the Obama years <laughs> <laughs> which is absolutely absurd and ridiculous the reason that we have more job opportunities is because President Trump implemented capitalist policies he cut taxes he slashed regulations he encouraged domestic energy production businesses started to hire now that the hiring has just come there's been a day Deluge of hiring. We've actually got seven million job openings and only 6.3 million right, people. That's good news. And, uh, listed and that, as unemployed. one would expect wages would still keep going up very quickly. I just have 10 seconds. Yep. But if you had to predict whether or not he gets a second term, if the economy continues on this course, wages keep going up, does the middle class come out and vote for him again? I sure hope so, because the president's out there fighting for Americans. Democrats are out there fighting the president. This president wants economic security, mm -hmm. foreign security, border security. The Democrats just want to beat the president. So America, focus. Focus on who's trying to help you, not on who's trying to get power and get reelected. Yeah, and I want us to turn into more of a cylinder. Forget this hourglass thing. Andy, thank you so much. Good to see you. <laughs> Did you guys see Chuck and Nancy last night?